racist or insensitive or something like that, and they and they canned him. I'm sure he did, but it's pro- I, 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 hold on. Hank Jr. Scandal Monday Night Football. Let's see. You can abbreviate that M and F, and you're cooler. Oh, I found it. Hold on. Let's see. Obama Hitler comment. Yeah, that'll do it. Yep, that'll. <laughs> yeah, that'll do it. If you're singing Monday Night Football and then you call the sitting president Hitler, you'll That's get canned. That's a good way to get in trouble. You'll get canned. That's a good way. <laughs> Which is kind of a shit. I like I. I don't know. I guess I got I got mixed feelings. On one hand, it's like you ought to be able to say what you want to say. Well, that was but... one of the ones where they're all like, First Amendment, First Amendment." I'm like, yeah, you can say anything you want, but that doesn't mean your employer has to keep you employed. I know, but there is, <laughs> but there is still something kind of shitty about losing your job over your opinion. Yeah, but I have lots of opinions too, and guess it's where I kind of shitty. But guess where I keep them? To this podcast. <laughs> well, in this podcast, but also. <laughs> In my head. I mean, look. Let's. I mean, here's a, here's. Let's let's be totally honest. There's a reason why you and I don't say the current companies where we work. Uh huh. We don't advertise any of that because mm-hmm. it's. You never know what somebody's going to get offended by. Well, sure. You know, anybody could it, it could get offended over anything. And if then the you're next in a thing position, you know, they're going to railroad you. Right. And they're going to call your employer and be like, "That person should be fired." If you're in a position, it's one thing. If it's one thing, if you make millions of dollars and you could, you know, you take the hit. But somebody like us. The millions that we make, <laughs> we are not quite in the same position to uh, take well, that kind of a hit. Sure, it's kind of shitty. You know I, what I mean? Yeah, if you want to call somebody out because you think they have a shitty opinion, I don't think there's anything wrong with that. If you want to call for their livelihood, I think right. I think that there, there's a line there. You're entitled that, to your opinion, but then if your employer decides to shit can you because of your opinion, you can't go crying about it because that's kind of what they do. I'm trying to see what he actually said. What did he actually say? Probably, I think that's probably the extent of what you need to know. He just <laughs> he likened the sitting president to. Okay, here we go. All right, so earlier, okay, hold on. Earlier Monday, Williams said on the Fox News Channel Fox and Friends show that he was not a fan of any of the Republican presidential candidates, and that the last summer's Gulf summit involving Obama, Vice President Joe Biden, House Speaker John Boehner, and uh, Ohio Governor John Kasich, Kasich? I don't Kasich. Know. the latter of which, by the way, those last two are both Republicans. Uh, what was a major mistake by the GOP? "Quote this: That would be like Hitler playing golf with uh, Netanyahu. Not hardly in the shape the country is in." Williams said. Okay, so after seeing that in context, quite <laughs> frankly, I think it's kind of <laughs> bullshit that Williams got pulled because he's all he's doing is making a comparison. He's saying sure. that like the two parties being in bed with each other, going to play mm-hmm, golf mm-hmm. is like Hitler and Netanyahu. They're basically saying like these are two completely opposites going out with two other completely opposites. Grant granted, Hitler and Netanyahu are on a very extreme part as opposed to Republicans it's, and Democrats. So it's certainly it's certainly a stretch, but again, NBC I think is the station has every right to you know, do it's what ESPN. They do. ESPN is owned by ABC, I believe. Was it ESPN? Yes. Okay. Which is Disney. I think uh, doesn't Disney own? Do I they? think they do. I think Disney owns. Disney owns ABC. Yes. Is that where running ABC football was? Uh, also D-E-S-P. owns ESPN? I think. Oh my God! Everybody owns everybody. Yeah. This is so confusing. Anyway, it is. They but have it, the, okay. So as that's his employer. That's their right. I don't necessarily. I don't necessarily disagree that, that that it's their right. Of course, they can fire whoever they want to fire for whatever reasons they want to. However, that being said. Dog just scared the shit out of me. My dog scared you? I thought it was a giant raccoon Aww, or something. Aw, she's going to lick you to death. She's going to lick you to death. Anyway, no, I, I personally, I, this is where me and you stand on opposite grounds. I think it's kind of shitty that someone can lose their gig off. Oh, I'm not like saying that. it's not shitty. I'm just saying that it's his employer one thing, had the right. If it's, it's one thing if like Hank Williams would have come out and say, boy, I wish somebody would assassinate this sitting. Pr-. That I could mm-hmm. understand. Like, yeah, you kind of can't get that ridiculous. But this here, just making a comparison, I I think. It's up for debate. and I don't think. To me, it's not even up for debate. To me, it's just mm-hmm. a, it's shitty that he got fired. To me. I agree with that. But, again, his we're employer getting, has that right. We're getting way too serious. <laughs> this is not what the show does. No. No, it's not. Talk about Miss Cleo again. 
You want to talk about this guy? It's Jenny that the uh, Ike Williams Jr. got fired from Monday Night Football. Why are you Italian? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I am Italian. <laughs> what if Miss Cleo were Italian? I make a shitty Miss Cleo. <laughs> I make a horrible Miss Cleo. <laughs> Call me now. Call me now. Hey, Williams just lost his job, man. <laughs> what? Why are you a Jamaican Italian? A Jamaican Italian. <laughs> Jamaican jerk and meatball, sir. <laughs> Don't forget to, do- to jerk on my meatballs. Jerk on my meatballs, man. Try my pasta, man. It's right. a me, a Cleo. <laughs> Can you imagine <laughs> freaking Gypsy jumping up and down, and jump, stomping on Goombas or running it's through, a me. hitting Koopa shells and taking? Anyway, all right, let's get out of this, shall we?